So hello, I'm Jonathan Van Tam. I'm Professor of Health Protection um, here in the Division of Epidemiology and Public Health in Nottingham. So the first question, I guess, um, if you're listening to this podcast is, well, what is health protection? And the answer is, it's an amalgamation of um, roles which we used to perform um, in terms of what used to be known as communicable disease control. And effectively, most of health protection is communicable disease control. Though on top of that now, we throw in chemical, biological and radiation hazards. Because the kind of response that one actually needs in the public health world to an infectious disease incident is often the same kind of principle-based response that one needs when there's a um, massive release of a toxic cloud of gas near to a housing estate from an industrial complex, etc. So that's health protection in a nutshell. And um, what we aim to do on this module is um, give students a proper understanding, a grounding in health protection. Now, um, it is an integral part of public health, whether you go into academic practice or whether you go back into service public health practice, you're likely to come across health protection incidents. For example, the summer barbecue where um, the, the guests are ill because they've all eaten meat that was incorrectly cooked uh, on the barbecue and Salmonella or Campylobacter are the organisms that have caused that illness in the guests or at a wedding feast and so forth. Um, in my case, influenza, we have um, very large and very serious epidemics some winters. And of course, most people who listen to this podcast will remember the swine flu pandemic in 2009, um, which was a major public health event worldwide. Um, new crises such as the Ebola crisis in, in West Africa, the MERS-CoV crisis in the Middle East and South Korea, those are the kind of things that we cover. Now, it's a very broad subject, and to do that, what we do is we um, have lecturers who are experts in their own particular piece of health protection, delivering a series of 15 or so lectures uh, in semester two of the, uh, of the MPH course. There are a number of um, practical scenarios and sessions throughout the module that break up the normal lecture-style format. And uh, look forward to seeing you.